All right, my name is Nathan. Uh, I have ankylosing spondylitis. I've had it for a few years now, and before that, when I was a little kid, I was diagnosed with um, juvenile rheumatoid arthritis, and uh, I had a bunch of eye issues, all sorts of stuff. Thankfully, it's it's gotten a little better, but it's kind of moved to my back these last few years. So, um, I was taking methotrexate a bunch, which was a really common uh, medication for people with those issues, and then had to step it up to Imbro when my flare-ups were getting super bad, and. I used to think that this was like a super rare thing, but then I'll go to the gym where like, you know, the TVs definitely like don't have me targeted. It's a public space. And there will be a bunch of advertisements for Humira and Embrol and all these injection stuff. So for whatever reason, I think a bunch of people are needing this stuff now more than ever, which is unfortunate, but also like I'm very thankful for this because I've had some really, really awful flare ups. And this is really the only thing that gives me relief. And I remember when I started, it was really freaky because you're injecting yourself with stuff. But it's not that bad. And uh, this is how you do it. You have like a little alcohol wipe. Wipe the spot on your thigh. Give it a second to dry. I have the Embril Shore, Shore Click. Um, Super nice, convenient. You don't see the needle. I think it's pretty small, if, even if you look in there. And then you just press this part down. And once you have that thing pressed, you hit the button. And then it clicks back out and you're done. Doesn't hurt. There's like a little pinch nothing crazy. I usually don't even uh, bleed for the most part, but sometimes there's like a little spot. So if you don't want to get any of that on your shorts or whatever you're wearing, it's always super easy to just put a little bandaid over it. And then you're done. So that's it. Just felt like making this video. I remember when I started this stuff, it was super freaky. And like, I looked up videos on YouTube and uh, <laughs> I would find people that were like almost crying when they were doing their injection, which isn't funny. I feel for those people, it's, it, it's a lot to deal with a disease like this and do that kind of medication. But uh, it's also not the, the best thing to watch before you're about to start it. So. Hopefully yours goes more like mine and um, man, it's so worth it. Like if you're taking this stuff, odds are you're hurting. I don't think they hand these, these things out to everybody. So um, I've had a really great experience with Embrel so far and uh, I'm constantly trying to um, do other things to help my health as well. Um, turned vegetarian last year, been stretching. Stretching has been a huge help. Stretching is the closest thing I've found to feeling like a medication that's uh, that's not one so yoga things like that definitely a recommendation and that's it um, I've been doing this for a little while now I'll show you um, all the other things I have I, I don't even know how many I have before I need to like recycle these things in their needle recycle program but that's it it's easy do it if you have this I'm sorry but also it helps and don't be freaked out by the shot. Good luck.